Hey guys, it's Bonnie. Today is going to be a really quick video showing you how I do my Havana twists. I've referenced my Havana twists in two other videos before. One showing you how I moisturize my hair and how Havana twist is a really good protective style for your natural hair. And another one showing you how I style my hair, which thank you guys who have subscribed to my channel from that video. It's been shared around Tumblr like every single day. Compared to other natural hair videos, it hasn't got that many views, but for me that's like, ah, over a thousand views, that's crazy. But today's video, I'm gonna show you how I actually install my Havana twist. Um, it's a little bit different how I usually do it, so I figured might as well do a tutorial on it. In the past when I've installed my Havana twist, sometimes by the time I've finished, I've realized that I've got sections too big or I've done some sections too small and I've run out of hair. And it will just, it's just very time consuming. And also to get the section right, that takes quite a while in itself. What I do now, which I find that's helped me a lot, I actually section my hair all over before I put in the Havana twist then all I have to do is twist, twist, twist and put them in and I'm done. The last time I put my Havana twist, I actually sectioned my hair and twisted it and I've rocked those twists like two days and then I decided to put in the twist. So my hair is freshly washed. I did a blowout. If you want to see a video of how I blow dry my hair, then let me know in the comments below. I never like to part straight down the middle. I just don't like the way it looks on me. <laughs> I kind of go off to the side. And from there, I just go straight back. I like to make sure that I have about three or four, like the first two rows coming from the back. I want to make sure that is good. I do everything by feel. <laughs> I get really hot and flustered if I have two mirrors and I'm trying to look and angle it. So I just kind of do it with feel. And with this comb, it helps because I know it's leaving a pretty much clean part every time. When you get to the middle, you can just do whatever you want. So I'm just gonna go ahead and do all that and I will catch up with you when I'm done. So the hair I'm using is by Gold. It says Noble, it's in the style Dreadlock. I got two different colors, color number two and number four. It's so long and it's really, 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 really soft. It's also a little bit smaller in width. I usually use about three or four strands, but I want to add about six strands to each twist, I guess, to make up for the bulk of the Havana twist. Okay, guys, so I'm back after a long night of twisting, and I'm just going to show you guys how I do these last two. The strands are thinner than what I'm used to. I said I was going to use about five, but in order for me to get it this thick, I have to add a lot more, maybe about seven or eight. I have about five strands and one strand from the old hair. I never make it too heavy at the edges or on the top area. This is a dark and lovely au natural anti-shrinkage 10 in 1 styles gele? Gele? I'm not sure how you say that, but that's what it looks like.
finished look guys as you can see my hair is a little bit curled at the end I was hoping to have bigger curls as I did the last time I had it in this picture here but it's fine I don't have the patience to do it all over again if you'd like to see how I style my twist then check out the video right here whatever tips that people can benefit from what I can benefit from let me know your thoughts in the comments below do you like how I did my Havana twist have you tried doing it this way and does it work for you and there's a big learning curve to doing protective styles I mean I'm not perfect but this is good compared to the first time I was doing these so if you like this video please let me know by giving it a thumbs up and sharing it and if you want to see more videos from me then you need to subscribe to my channel so that's it guys bye see you in the next video